Capitol Hill now, where the Senate is taking up the $95 billion foreign aid bill for Ukraine and Israel, which also includes a ban on TikTok. Senior White House correspondent Selena Wang has the story. Good morning, Selena. Hey, good morning, George. In just a few hours, the Senate is going to start voting on that $95 billion aid package to Israel, Ukraine, and Taiwan. For America's allies, this could not come fast enough. $60 billion is going to Ukraine. They've been running out of ammunition, so this would resupply their defenses and could help slow down Russia's advances. Now, President Biden spoke to Ukrainian President Zelensky yesterday, vowing to sign this bill into law as soon as possible. And House Speaker Mike Johnson, he put his job on the line to get this done defying the far right wing of his party. But at least for now, his job is safe with this legislation expected to speed through the Senate. What about this TikTok ban? Yeah, George, so this legislation, it includes a ban on TikTok if its Chinese parent company ByteDance doesn't sell the app within a year. But look, this could be a very long and complicated process. TikTok, they were going to fight this in the courts and the Chinese government could block any potential sale. And even if this gets to the point where it is banned in the U.S., it's not just going to disappear off of everyone's phones. Instead, it could die a slow death where the app is banned in the app store so new users can't join and existing users can't get their updates but for now, all of your TikTok videos are safe. George. Okay, Selena Wang, thanks very much.